hello students hope you all are fine at home today i am here to teach you physics of class 11th and the very first chapter is physical world in this chapter we read about the basic thing about the physics the very first thing is what is physics it is a branch of science which is devoted to study to the study of nature and natural phenomena laws that explain the physical world for example the repetition of day and night the annual cycle of seasons the eclipse the tides the volcanoes the rainbows the motion of sun to the motion of electron the heating up of glass of water to the cooling of stars the flow of river the depth of sea and so on all are the things understand by the physics in earlier days it was said that physics is the king of science and mathematics is the queen the next topic is unification and reductionism unification it is an attempt to explain various phenomena by few or some basic laws it is an attempt to see physical world through some universal laws which can be applied to different domains agar hum isko easy language mein baat kare ki unification kya hai to bahut dher sare phenomena ko kisi ek law laws se samjhaya jaye this is called unification like with the help of the law of gravitation you can explain falling of apple on the ground moving of moon around earth motion of moon around sun and the next example is from maxwell's fourth equation we can explain complete electrostatics electrodynamics magnetism electromagnetic wave the next thing is reductionism properties of a bigger or more complex system from properties of constituent particles अगर हम इसको ईजी लैंग्वेज में समझना चाहें तो आप किसी बड़ी प्रॉब्लम को उसको छोटे छोटे पार्ट पर डिवाइड करके सॉल्व करें दैट इज़ कॉल्ड रिडक्शनिज्म नाउ वट आर द स्कोप्स एंड एक्साइटमेंट ऑफ फिजिक्स द बेसिक स्को स्कोप इज डिवाइडेड इन टू टू पार्ट माइक्रोस्कोपिक एंड माइक्रोस्कोपिक्स दैट यू कैन गेट फ्रॉम द दिस फ्लो चार्ट दैट आई हैड गिवन हुए हो scope of physics is from 10 to the power minus 30 kg that is mass of electron 10 to the power 55 kg that is mass of unknown known universe the scope is from a vacuum to infinity the scope is from 10 to the power minus 14 meter radius of nucleus to to the 10 to the power 26 meter length of galaxies these are the excitement of physics now the next thing is physics technology and society technology give rise to new physics like how to improve steam engine that we can study from physics only physics give rise to new technology like with the help of electricity and magnetism we developed wireless communication technologies and there is a table in your ncert in which physicist 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 major contribution or you can say that discovery and their country of origin is mentioned so you can read this read this table from the ncert only there are some fundamental forces that, that are in nature that you have to read that is gravitational force electromagnetic force strong nuclear force and weak nuclear force gravitational force is a long range force and doesn't require any medium while the electromagnetic force is a long range force it does also doesn't require any medium it's a strong force while the gravitational force is the weakest force of nature strong nuclear force as it is clear from the name only it is the strongest force it does not uh, depend on the charges and it bind the proton 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 neutron and neutron neutron inside the nucleus 
while the weak nuclear force appears only in certain nuclear processes such as beta decay it is a short range force that is 10 to the power -15 meter it is stronger than gravitational force but weaker than electromagnetic force okay thank you